Hey guys, welcome to Drupal Learn. Today we are going to see how to use Drupal color box module to display any content or images in a pop up. Now let's go ahead and get started. Let's go to the side, go again, and create some sample contents. Show it content, article. We don't need that money, we just need maybe five. It's done. Now let's go to content. Just pick one. We have an image here. Now we'll go ahead and install the color box module. I'm using Lando, so Lando Composer right here to call color box. Now let's leave it for now so that the model gets installed. And let's go here, page, and uh, I'll just search for the color box module. to see if there is any instructions for the installation other than the standard method. So let's go to the readme. So let's go to the installation. It says install the module as normal. So it's a standard installation. However, they are suggesting to load the libraries from this github url so let's copy the url let's see if the module is installed yes the module is installed now let's see where to place the libraries it should be placed under libraries color box in jquery color box min.js there is no directory named libraries so we're gonna create one get into it and we'll download the library here let's download it master.zip let's unzip it so it is unzipped it's unzipped as color box if in master however we want it only to be color box so we'll just rename this Just this color box. Okay, and we can get rid of this master zip file. Now let's go ahead and install the module from the admin end. Search for color box. And install the module is installed let's search for it again see if there is any configs because there are configs let's go ahead in the config what does it says so these are some style options we can now either on the let's just leave it to default for now we're not customizing any Now let's go to see the help of color box. Once we place it, I think this all should be good enough. Color box settings. Let's choose the custom. These are options on how to control the pop up and stuffs, which we don't need right now. So we'll leave it as default let's click on this default okay they've added sample images so let's go back to our page refresh this let's go ahead and edit this so ideally it should be simply adding classes so this is an image field 
so let's go to article and manage fields sorry it's manage display because as per the doc it says should be display formatters so let's go to the display and uh, you have the image field here format is image let's click on this gear icon so link image to nothing doesn't have anything Ideally, a color box should have such settings. So, push the cache for once. Yeah, now you can see. So, it's a cache. Now you can see the option color box. Click on it hit save now come back to the page now if you click on it there you go you can see the image loaded also you can inspect it you can see here the class color box is added so obviously color box is gonna work just fine Thanks for watching the tutorial guys, make sure you subscribe to my channel.